Getting ahead of myself. <laughs> got two hats. I'm thinking as a pastor. I got to think as a funeral director. I'll tell you what. You come do it, Rashad. I've been talking all too much. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, uh, reiterating what the pastor said. Uh, this is this will conclude the service. Beginning from the rear, you may come forward and view, and then the family will take their time and view, and then there is a reception immediately following. Uh, I want to stand here on behalf of the family and thank those of you who have shown your love and support yesterday and today and the days in the past. But I'm going to ask that as we move from this day, you continue to be of support to the family, uh, not just on Valentine's Day or on a birthday, but just any random day. How about tomorrow? Mm -hmm. you know, any, any phone call, a card, email, text message, anything that you can do would be greatly appreciated. If none of that can be achieved, I know a prayer works just the same. Amen? Amen. 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 And to the family, on behalf of everyone here at Chapel of the Chimes, we want to thank you for allowing us to serve you during your time of bereavement. Understand that although the services are complete today, our service to you will last all eternity. Anything that you need from us, please let us know as we are here for you always. Ladies and gentlemen, come forward. And for those of you who are not going on to the reception, uh, may God be with you all. Go in peace. And after you view, you are dismissed.